Gold Corp is uh, one of the largest gold companies in the world, and uh, we have a flagship operation in northwestern Ontario called the Red Lake Gold Mines, and it's the largest gold mine in Canada. We have just uh, undergone a, a merge uh, between Placer Dome and, and Gold Corp. Um, and it's been a challenge to integrate the sites together. We uh, had four data centers spread out uh, at the different buildings, so we definitely needed to consolidate. And initially we looked at the traditional uh, uh, layout of a data center, but as, as time became a restriction, we wanted something that was going to be longer term, and we wanted also something that was movable, uh, because we, the future mine might not be where we were going to build the data center. We we're trying to uh, build a new data center that was SOX compliant and uh, at the same time we had a large room that was uh, that it would have like very large cooling requirements so we were looking at a solution that was more efficient. And to be able to um, bring that to Red Lake which is an isolated area um, that impacted some of the choices that we had. We're working with uh, different vendors to try to find a solution. I think uh, IBM was one of them, uh, HP was another, and uh, just from what we saw, IBM seemed to offer the uh, best solution. I have now one data center to manage, so it reduces my risk. Uh, it, it's easier. Uh, the equipment is all new in, in, in the SMDC. It's running really well. Uh, we have uh, now sensors that uh, uh, alerts us when there's a, an issue, as opposed to having to manually manage some of those things. So those, those are time savers for us. We know at any point in time what uh what the state of the cooling is and how much cooling is required for the different servers that we have in the rack. Or we'll actually be notified if there is any loss of power or any loss of cooling. Well, originally when we were designing the uh, data center without the SMDC, there seemed to be more requirements for uh, things like raised floors, more air conditioning uh, capacity, and uh, it just turned out to be probably a more expensive route to take. The SMDC solution was actually probably a, a less expensive way to go and uh, long term as well for, for energy use. The second thing that we're doing here as a green initiative is to uh, capture the heat that's generated by the condensers and uh, use that as a supplement to our heating system here at the, at the warehouse. And there's also the fact that uh, the SMDC is designed so that you don't cool the whole room but you cool the equipment which, which is great to be able to work in a room and not freeze. IT in a mining company, we don't make money, we spend money. So the SMDC being scalable will allow us to maybe move the equipment and not have to rebuild a new data center. Through the implementation of the SMDC, uh, first of all, my staff was able to grow because they, they work with uh, very specialized people. Uh, it gave uh, us state-of-the-art equipment. Uh, obviously, that means durability for us, it means less, less help desk tickets. Uh, so totally a, a more stable environment and reliable, and, and for us means that way we can spend our time uh, elsewhere. IBM and, and APC are partners uh, with this uh, solution and there was visibility from both of them during the process. Uh, IBM came in, uh, you know, kind of, it was almost like a check to make sure that the APC delivered what they, what they had committed to deliver uh, through IBM uh, and then APC were the specialists in the implementation. and. and it was awesome because they really made sure that everything was built to par and if it wasn't, no go. From my perspective, I would definitely recommend uh, an SMTC solution for, for anybody that's looking to uh, reduce their cooling costs and uh, to have the flexibility of being able to uh, move the equipment. Uh, at their discretion. For the SMDC uh, implementation, uh, I would definitely recommend IBM uh, and, and in conjunction with their partner, APC. Uh, both together uh, were able to deliver uh, you know, professionalism and, and specialty in, in, in that field. And once implemented, um, I was certainly satisfied.